In its experience, ESB International has come to believe that many of the critical decisions needed to give a high return on investment are made before the wind farm construction gets underway. The environmental study findings for this site, at high elevation, with severe slopes and sudden weather changes, form the basis of the construction plan. As works begin, the impact on the local community is addressed. While widening roads, installing drainage and fencing, existing amenities are maintained. Consideration of soil mechanics dictates the most appropriate excavation and reinstatement techniques for building roadways and hard stands and installing the surface water drainage system. Management of excavated materials includes recycling, landscaping and improvement of the neighbouring farmland in accordance with the local conditions, making environmental and economic sense. The stability of the tower will depend on the correct installation of the foundation. A standard foundation template has been designed for this project. Excavations are 16 metres in diameter, down to bedrock, with a blinding layer of concrete to provide a safe work surface. Accurate forming and positioning of the foundation steel to reinforce the concrete base will guarantee security of the towers for their lifetime. Quality control measures, which began at the batching plant, continue on site. Concrete sampling, level checking, and temperature monitoring for several days after the pour are important aspects of the project management system. Planning for all eventualities includes a spare concrete pump in case of a breakdown, as the pour must be completed in one single operation. The block is then covered with all over insulation, as we can see in this example, which was poured one week earlier. With floating complete at the stage one pour, the concrete pump is transferred to allow the second pour at the neighboring site. In a 13 hour day, which began with a crew briefing at 0530 hours, a total of one complete foundation will have been poured before the final concrete truck is washed down. The value of accurate design and proper site preparation is evident as the tower and other components arrive on site. The hard stands must cater for the 1200 ton lever crane, its 300 ton companion and all the ancillary equipment and materials. A multinational team including a Dutch transport company, a Belgian coordinator, a Spanish direction team are brought together with the Danish supplier under overall management of ESB International. Weather forecasting plays a crucial part. Once tower erection begins, it is essential to get the 90 ton nacelle landed to stabilize the 63 meter high structure. Similarly, once blade erection starts, the full set must be fitted in quick succession. Electrical and civil works continue in tandem so that the farmland can be secured and the wind farm be commissioned on time and within budget. <laughs>